Hello guys and welcome to Rage Quit Gaming. This time we're looking at Unepic. With me as always is Daz. You alright? Yeah, hello. I'm good. I'm ready for it. So Unepic um, is described as a 2D RPG platformer. It's been developed by one man. Um, it's now out on Steam um, as an early release. Um, it's described as a single player being 100% completed with around 20 hours uh, of total gameplay. Um, but he's looking to develop the multiplayer aspects. Um, we're not going to look at the multiplayer too much in this video. Um, although if it's something that's requested we can look at it again in the future, can't we? We can. Um, I'm just hoping it's going to be epic, not an epic. Well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, hopefully the title doesn't indicate what's going on. We're just going to dive straight into the options menu and briefly have a look. Very basic stuff. It's a video setup. Some sound options. Gameplay. You can calibrate the controllers, um, which is quite nice. Oh, and we dive back straight back out again. Um, you've got some different language options. Quite a large variety, actually. On English is interesting. English. Yeah, what is an English all about? <laughs> yeah, no idea whatsoever. And of course, the, the basic controls there as well. Um, but we're going to dive into single player. Let's we're go. We're going to do the tutorial so you guys can have an option. Oh, uh, what name are we going to go for? What, what are you going to go for? Don't ask me. Don't, don't, I'm no good with names. I can never come up with any ideas. Well, it's we're usually very bland. <laughs> we're going to go for Sir. Bobbington. Okay, we'll go with so that. So Bobbington. That, that works. It works for me. It's an epic name. Okay, so you've got four difficulty settings to start with. Um, you've got easy, uh, which as you can see, uh, monsters deal less damage and your health regenerates. The game saves automatically. Medium, none of the above except for your game still saves automatically. Hard, you must save it manually. Monsters can see you from far away. Um, but you do get an extra skill point while levelling up. Hard, you get two extra uh, skill points when levelling up. Monsters can see from far away. You're not invulnerable when being hit. Um, and you must save your game um, manually. I'm guessing when it says you're not invulnerable to being hit, that you can be spam hit. Oh, I think perhaps sure. on the easier levels, if you get hit, you're like temporarily immune so that you can't be just chain killed in a set heartbeat, I guess. I just like the way they describe it as hard plus plus. Plus plus. I want to know what where hard plus went. Yeah. <laughs> but Just anyway. Just that one and then went to uh, even harder. Yeah. Maybe. Right. Well, we're going to dive into medium. Let's go for a nice even one. Um, so we got we got some setting the stage here. These guys are sat around doing a pen and paper RPG by the looks of it. Um, we've got obviously the dungeon master kicking things off, and then we've got our character. I believe is the orange hooded one. Um, so they're talking about different bits and pieces about their game, and he's saying that different things should work because he's played in video games, and they're laughing at him because he's obviously not quite as good as RPG oh, oh, pen oh, RPGs. Oh, the jokes. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So he's rolled a d20. <laughs> And he's taken two skeletons, and then he hears a click, and sp and a spear springs up just under his feet. So it's just basically setting the scene of 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 okay. this pen RPG that that everyone. Oh yeah, it's the B. Have you ever played a pen RPG? Uh, pen and paper yeah. RPG. I I, ne I I haven't. I've done a lot of gaming. We play yeah. board games and stuff, don't we? But um, I've never actually played a pen and paper Dungeons and Dragons. Anyway, so he's just left to go to the toilet or something, um, and the the lights have gone off. Um, uh -oh. Spoilers, bad language. It's a bit harsh. Um, so the lights have gone out. He's not quite sure what's going on. He's trying to find a door to get back to his friends and and the epicness that is going on. Well, the unepicness. Um, so right, find the lighter in your inventory. Once you find it, select the equip option and close the inventory with the I button again. So here we are. Here's a here's a shirt, my t-shirt and jeans, which gives me protection against fire and frost. Apparently, I'm not quite sure how that. Might. Oops. Well, right mouse button closes it. Clearly does. A little bit. Here we are. Oh, he's a he's a little dude down here. Look at me. Right. This is the toilet, is it? Yeah. 
stone walls, okay. columns, darkness, where the hell am I? I'm pretty sure that if I'd gone into the toilet and lit my zippo and this is what I'd see, I'd probably be thinking the same thing. So he's thinking that he's taken a hallucinogen. Okay, um, it's one of those sort of uh, gaming nights, is it? <laughs> <laughs> We're going to play D&D and just get stoned. <laughs> yeah. Um, Rage Quick Gaming does not uh, endorse any illicit drug use. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> um, right, so he's just got hit by the traps. He's still thinking this is in his own head by the looks of it. Yes, so he's imagining himself in the RPG. Must be in a castle or dungeon that my subconscious has created. Okay, what are drugs working? So somehow he thinks he's been drugged. I'm, I'm not sure what he thinks of his friends that he thinks this is possible, but... Him tripping balls. They yeah. just date raped him. <laughs> date raped him by Dungeons and Dragons. I mean, that's got to be the most lamest way to get date raped ever, hasn't it? Holy crap. Quite liking the graphic style. I'm enjoying this. This looks pretty cool. The atmospheric, the light, the light dynamics are pretty good. Um, apparently we're going this way. I see a little more, but uh, yeah, we're in a dark dungeon. Yeah. Well, it's quite atmospheric though, mm -hmm. I think. Okay. Uh, let's go down here. Look at all these corpses and crap. Oh my god. What's going on? Looks like we have a guest and he's an armed. Okay, Mr. Purple Hoodie. Uh, no, 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 no. I was just leaving. He's going to offer hospitality. Doesn't yeah. look like he wants that. Okay. So. Okay. Oh god, he's got. Is, is he going inside him? Oh, was there was a blue light. So he's gone inside him to try and possess him, okay. and then he's realised he can't control it. Oh. He can't. <laughs> that's got to be the worst possession ever. <laughs> Owned. <laughs> he's trapped within this body, this prison of flesh. Okay. <laughs> I'd be pissed off as well, yeah. It's a reasonable question. Okay. Okay, let's skip some of this. Okay, so, yeah. so basically, it's setting the scene that um, he's taken let's over his body. Um, it's not worked. So the only way that he can now unpossess him is to wait until he dies. Okay. Um, he's trying to rib him um, by saying that, uh, look at all the bones, you're going to join all these bones. Oh, jumping. What have we got? Oh, a sword. Oh, that's always handy. All right, let's get let's get the sword. When it lets you. Um, yeah, I mean he's possessed you. If you have a sword, um, it's not really gonna hurt him, is it? Let's be honest. So if we go in and equip the sword, unless it's obviously a sword of unpossession. Yes. Uh, well, classic. Yeah, I can mm. see why you'd say that. Um, I'm not quite sure how you attack. Oh, spacebar. Oh! Look at the loot! <gasps> Gold is at nearly two grand and a grand an ounce. With just one of these coins, he could buy a PS3. Okay. It's a hallucination. He still believes it's a hallucination. You buy powerful artifacts and deadly weapons. Why would he give an invoice? No, I'm sure. We're picking up gold. Pick it all up. Pick up all the gold. Yeah, I want all of it. Just keep, just keep picking it up. I don't trust him because I mean the 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 evil dude is wanting me to pick up the gold. I don't care. It's gold. Oh, I want the gold. We've got fourteen. Then you've still left some gold. There's a whole pile of it. He's Is losing his strength. Yeah, I'm losing hit points. Okay, is the gold like poisoned? I think it may be. Yeah, apparently... Okay. Okay, don't pick up the gold. Don't pick up the gold. No, don't pick up the gold. <laughs> it poisoned oh, the gold. God. It literally killed us. Uh, we're restarting all over again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, okay. Oh, good start. Good, good, good start there. Um, well, that was unepic by me. <laughs> yeah. Let's skip through this and get back <laughs> and not pick up the gold. Don't, don't pick up the gold. <laughs> oh my god. I thought it was part of the tutorial. No. <laughs> Holy crap. The, okay, I like this. I like this. This game is not pissing about. 
It's like, I'm going to kill you. Bye! <laughs> sadistic bastard! Mind you, he is a sadistic bastard! Well, See, I, I him, like yeah. this. I like this a lot. No, I'm not going to pick up the coins. Not falling for that, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Fool me twice, shame yep. on me. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I wonder whether it would have said something different if I hadn't done it, because that that seems to have picked up that I've. Well, um, who would have known? Yeah, we might. We might. Oh, I would have picked. <gasps> a snake. It's enormous. Shit! <laughs> that mother Hubbard is as tall as me. Yeah, it is a big ass snake. <laughs> owned. Yeah, Goddamn owned. Chesticle. Press enter in front of the chest to loot it. Does he want you to pick it up, though? Because if he does, don't do it. I know, I know. I think we're learning, learning here not to trust. You're, you're in a demon, literally. Don't, don't trust them. Maces and swords are super effective against solid objects and armoured monsters. Swords and daggers are less effective. Use the mace against the barrel. Okay. I like that there's some sort of physics y sort of components to this. Let's break this stuff. Let's pick up all the epic loot. Look at all the arrows. Don't need to break Have that. Not yet, but maybe in here. No, but we get some more coins. So, what are you thinking about this game so far? Um, it's, it's, let's get a little further into it. Yeah, it's looking quite good again. Um, I'm liking it. To swap between your weapons without having to open the inventory, you can quickly assign a quick key. Uh, selecting, okay, so you can bind stuff, okay. So if we have this as a sign shortcut, um, one, and then this as two. So then I should be able to go one, get the sword out, own the snakey, that's it, and then, then, oh, then smash the barrels. You, you are just epic. I, I'm certainly not unepic now, am I? Oh, am I going to jump off this? Apparently that didn't. There was, there was a risk. <laughs> Apparently it didn't hurt. <laughs> oh, a bow. Okay, because you picked up some arrows. Equip that bad boy. Well, I'm just going to assign it to a shortcut at the minute. Let's not go rushing into things. Ah, oh, screw it. Yeah, let's let's get the bow out. Um. A torch. Let's light it because it's really dark in here. Okay. Yeah, because you have been going on your on your lights this whole time. Yeah, I know my Zippo. Bloody yeah. amazing, this Zippo. It's not melted or burnt your hands at all. Oil lamp or something like that. Better light that too. There we go. Belmont then. doesn't show up and start putting him out with his whip. What the hell? Who's Belmont? Uh, I think he's still tripping balls. Hey, dark smoky dude. What's your name? I have no name. Okay. Uh -huh. So it's a shadow, it's just a minion. Okay, anyway. More more story. Yeah, yeah, you... more story. Which we're not really going into. Holy crap. There's a, there is a lot of it though. <laughs> there is a lot of... Yada, 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 and... At the end of the day, we're just epic, so... Well, not unepic, that's for damn certain. Another chesticle. Potion of minor he Oh, could I light that? Is it? Oh, oh yes. Oh. Oh! That's what you want. You hit that with your mace. Yeah. I'm just trying to work at more arrows. Oh. Your mace of undying. Yes. So it's saying that I should um, I should assign a so let's assign a shortcut so it's four for healing so you can see that they're all piling up in that bottom bit which is quite useful. Which is nice. <gasps> Ding! Did you get a cheat for that? I don't know if I got a, a light five lanterns. <laughs> yeah. Ding! <laughs> Quest complete. Game over. Why is it? I saw it. Crouch near an edge to illuminate the area below. Oh, oh! Look at that. That that would have been easier than jumping down last time, wouldn't it? Oh, uh. 
kill it. Squash it. I don't know what it is. Just, just kill it. I don't need to worry about what it is. Oh no, I healed. Oh, no! You healed. I was trying to use my, my bow. Oh, you are an epic. That's cool. Okay, yeah, so that's that's nice. Was it, was it a spider? Was it a rat? I don't know what What's these goddamn coming? things are. It looks like when you get too close it starts to shake and... Yeah, they're spiders. No. What the hell is that? Die! It's, a big it's like a shadowy ball of doom. Let's get up there. No, let's get up there. Ooh. That's... yeah, you are. Oh, no, I'm pressing the wrong button, that's why. Here we go. Yeah, I have noticed. <laughs> really? What gave it away? Uh, let's get the bow back out. Let's get that mitten up. Oh god, you chief! <laughs> For each five, or is it like five in a room? In a... God damn you little things. I don't know what you are, but you will die! Uh, I'm going for spiders. Is that what you think they are, is it? I can go with that. Well, there's spider webs nearby. Um, I've no idea what that thing is, but... I know, I don't know what this is. Some sort of spider spawner sack. A spider spawner sack? A spider sack. spawner sack. Okay. See what I did there? <laughs> <laughs> right. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna end it here, I think, because um, otherwise we could just keep playing forever. Um, let us know what your thoughts are about um, the review, what you feel about the game as well. Um, if you want us to see to do more, maybe make a series on it. Do like it. Uh, do leave a comment below. Um, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to support us in our future endeavors. Thank you very much, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.